This beautiful garden describes itself as Auckland's best kept secret. Maybe it's Auckland's equivalent of the Garden of Eden. Well, almost. It's actually called Eden Garden. Situated only a few kilometres from downtown Auckland in Epson's Omana Avenue, it's a popular place for visitors all year round. For there's always something of interest and in flower. This weekend is extra special as it's the Tulip Festival with even more visitors than usual. Lots of magnolia and flowering cherry. Entertainment. Refreshments. And stalls for enthusiasts. But it's the tulips most have come to see and photograph. Away from the tulips, there's the rest of the garden to be explored. On further into paths that take you around in circles with many nooks and hidden areas, thick vegetation and vivid colours, with the sound of birds, especially tui, in the trees above, rhododendrons. Just over there is the summit of Mount Eden itself, one of Auckland's volcanic cones. Magnolia flowers. Azalea and daffodils. We climb the Brumiliad path to one of the lookouts. Mount Hobson in the centre and on out across eastern suburbs. The rocks remind us that 50 years ago this area was an overgrown abandoned quarry and rubbish dump. Then in 1964 Jack Clark and other dedicated garden enthusiasts started converting this five and a half acre site into the world class garden it is today. 
Eden Garden is a non-profit society and the garden is maintained by a dedicated team of volunteers. Exploring the garden one comes across many seats, not just for relaxing, for many carry memorials in memory of loved ones, not just on seats but also on rocks. What a splendid way to preserve someone's memory. Time to return to the outside world and head home. Past the late afternoon cafe patrons, the beautiful magnolia, and the splendid tulips. For yes, Eden Garden is well worth a visit at any time of the year. <laughs>